have you been holding up, Miss? Uh, good. Uh, just really disappointed in relics, but other than that, you know. In what regard? Um, the fact that when I broke up with him, I told him that I needed him to learn to be an independent person and be on his own and become a man without, you know, not because I feel like I was becoming his world and I wanted him to like thrive on his own. And mm -hmm. he kept telling me, oh, I'm going to do this. I'm going I'm to become DOJ. And I said, well, don't become DOJ if it's because of me. Become DOJ because you want to, you know. Yeah, because I want you he never once spoke about being a lawyer. Yeah. Yeah, so, and then the minute I I tell him, you know, I want you to go and be on your own, be your own man, what does he do? He tells me he tried to apparently join you guys, and then I find out he's back to doing crime, which he's not even good at. He tried joining so, us, but I shut him down, honestly. Yeah, I'm like, I told you go learn and be independent, and you go and try to join a gang again, or whatever you guys are. Sorry, I don't know if you're a gang, but, uh, no, it's fine. yeah, I'm like, seriously, he can't. Ugh. I mean, I want him to do what makes him happy, and if crime makes him happy, fine, but could you just do something that's... Yours. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you're looking for an uh, independent man. I... Yeah. Understand. I do. Yeah. I'm not looking for an independent man, but I get you. Yeah. You know? <laughs> I mean, maybe he needs yeah. to sit down and really think about what he wants out of life, you yeah. know? And I started, I felt bad because I, I started, like, when he told me about his ex-girlfriend dying in his arms, I was like, then I was terrified of ever leaving him because if I left him, I didn't know how he might act because he literally, he was, he's always telling me I would never have killed myself. And I'm like, I'm not saying that, but you would have gone off the deep end and look what happened. You've gone off the deep end. You're back doing crime shit. So... This is exactly what I didn't want him to do, and I'm just really sad and disappointed, and I was hoping he was going to prove me wrong, and I, a little bit of hope, but... You think had he proved you wrong, yeah. you would have taken him back? Probably. I mean, I still love him, but I don't, like... I don't know. I miss no, him. I understand. But... You, you, you... Yeah. But there's still something keeping you from, you know, fully committing yourself to him. Yeah. And it's that, it's that, uh, lack of individuality. Yeah. And when he, mm -hmm. I met his, uh, old boss and his boss gave him these two swords and I was like, it said heart of a warrior and protector. And I'm like, then fucking learn to be one. Because to me, I don't feel protected by him. I know he has a heart of a warrior somewhere inside him. But, like, doing crime is not the heart of a warrior. Yeah, like, ugh. It's so frustrating. Because he, he is, and I know he wants to be those two things. But to me, I felt like I was the one wearing the pants. And, I mean, not to be misogynistic or, you know, that girl. I actually like a manly man. So, yeah, I understand. Yeah. It just sucks when, like, I know I'm a badass, but when it comes to being with my man, I want my, to feel like he really is protecting me. And instead, every time the shit went down, I had to first put relics down so I could fight because <laughs> he got in my way. He was a hindrance. So, right. right. Yeah. This is more than a ramen shop. I'm going to be doing yeah. a used car business as well. Oh, nice. And, yeah. Maybe that'll motivate him to kind of start thinking the bigger picture. Because, yeah, sure, I do crime, but yeah, I haven't done an ounce of crime tonight. <laughs> he just knocked his ass out. <laughs> he deserves it. <laughs> well, but anyway, yeah. yeah. So, uh, sorry if I interrupted y'all's meeting. I just, I thought you guys were open. They told me. It's fine. I yeah. had to talk to him about something. Okay. Well, you guys be safe. Make sure you eat. Make sure you drink. You as well. Um, make sure Relic eats and drinks, of course. Um, not that I care, but you know. Mm -hmm. Sure you don't, Susie. All right. Thanks, Jen. Bye.